Uh, welcome YouTube, welcome Rumble, uh, welcome possibly back you BitShifter, and plus uh, other video platforms. This is uh, William Drosky, owner of uh, DemoExperts.com. I'm also like uh, another uh, website I manage is Private Wealth Focus. And I was like, uh, hopefully, uh, would like, uh, would have had issues with the uh, bit shooter, which had problems with uh, uploading uh, videos and probably uh, logging in. Because uh, uh, when my computer wasn't able to, to log in, uh, plus uh, issues with uh, uploading uh, some videos. So I had to delete the entire channel and start over again. Obviously, uh, I have a few uh, videos loaded back up there since some of my uh, older videos from YouTube. And so obviously, I had to delete another account at uh, iConnect.fx. Uh, I Connect FX, you know, with that website, uh, it's a little complicated, so I, I might like uh, start up another counter, but like uh, Stephen Benoon, like uh, said, mentioned something like they have good webinars, but like have like uh, webinars uses are at uh, go to webinars or go to web. Meetings uh, dot com, and uh, plus there's a few other places uh, you know, I'm setting up with um, other various uh, alternative uh, video channels such as Rumble. I'm also on Patreon. Some people like uh, are using uh, Brighton, and some people are on Vimeo, but. With uh, almost on Gab, and some people are using a uh, parlor and like a uh, telegram. But I was on parlor when uh, Dan Bunny Jesus was first uh, launching it and being a partner with it. There, so the things you got to understand with a lot of these uh, dot connectors, you know, like I mentioned, uh, Michael Jaco. You know, you know, Simon Parks, you know, Charlie Ward, you know, but uh, the big one was, uh, I don't mention, was uh, David Icke, which she might got a lot of things right there, doing uh, things that's going on that uh, pretty much predicted years ago with, uh, authoritarians and uh, the global empire which is a uh, fascist dictatorship there and if you go back in history like uh, with um, of uh, David Icke or uh, how he started his uh, writing books there like I mean he's there with uh, he's pretty much involved with the uh, dark arts and like many people like getting uh, involved with the uh, dark arts, you know, divination, uh, tarot cards, uh, spirit channeling there. And that's, you know, if you go back in the Bible there, you know, the Bible verses like uh, where it's strictly forbidden there. And as you go back and like, uh, you know, the commandments there. You should have no like gods before me, and you should not bow down to them and uh, worship graving images, sir. That's pretty much what people are doing right now, especially during like uh, the mainstream holidays, such as uh, Christmas, uh, New Year's, like uh, Valentine's Day, Easter. St. Patrick's Day, Thanksgiving. Uh, they're, they're pretty much uh, been uh, pagan, paganized and pagan roots. 
Uh, like like I want to like uh, don't want to be digressing too much, since uh, there's a lot of people that want to be obliterating the truth, and a lot of people are kind of be uh, kind of walking back on their uh, belief system, their beliefs, you know, where they took a strong against stand uh, against this proverbial evil. You know, it might be in like um, war fatigue, battle fatigue, being like uh, tired and weary. Uh, it's like uh, hate what you do on there and hate what I got uh, talking about. Take your head and smash the keyboard there if you like uh, hate the truth there and hate the facts there. Smash your head on the keyboard there. It might be doing you all that good there. But basically, uh, and the uh, end result is uh, you end up with a broken keyboard. <laughs> but it's like, you know, pointing out like uh, some of these uh, heresies, the hypocrisy on some of these uh, religious characters. And they end up uh, having like a big, like a following of their clicks there that usually get upset or. And I usually respond like, oh, you attacked my precious, you attacked my precious there, you attacked my religion, you attacked my ministry. And, and it's like, uh, the thing is, is like, uh, that they're own, their own worst enemy. And they like, uh, have very little discernment there, but a lot of them been uh, gathering a lot of knowledge there on the way things are, but they choose to walk away from the true Messiah, the true uh, Sovereign of the Universe. So they uh, end up getting in the uh, dark arts and going back into secularism. Secular humanism was pretty much promoted by Gene Roddenberry, you know, and also with the Star Trek series, you know, The Next Generation, and it's like I've been toying with the idea of uh, putting on my uh, domain names, uh, local insight uh, marketing, Local marketing uh, insights there, but I'll probably put that uh, domain there so you can look at it, even though it's been parked in like uh, my uh, website servers. So, yeah, I've been like uh, marketing uh, heavily on social media. My YouTube channels there, been uh, outsourcing uh, some work on Fiverr there. And I think I'll probably get some other work. I've been promoting uh, my Instagram channel and various other channels that I have at other networks. Or, so uh, if you're looking for a way to earn money from home, you know, want to learn about uh, entrepreneurship there, try to uh, get away with uh, escape what's going on and around the world since uh, with all this uh, totally evil and draconian measures but it's only going to be getting worse so my website stomachexperts.com you know you want to be shaking the money tree and share this video far and wide there and all good luck there and wakes for the next video there